In this video, we are going to look at a head pain referral test in migraine and tension type headache. Get our very own assessment ebook and mobile app. Links are in the video description. Hi, and welcome back to Physio Tutos. While migraines and tension type headaches are primary headaches, the literature claims that there may be accompanying occipital and neck symptoms. Different observations in migraine and tension type headaches suggest that afferent cervical nociceptive inputs are involved in primary headaches. Watson et al. from 2012 investigated if and to what extent head pain could be reproduced in tension type headache and patients with migraine without aura during manual examination of the cervical spine, specifically the atlanto-occipital to C2, C3 segments. In their study, the symptom response and grading of intervertebral mobility achieved an intra-radar reliability of kappa 0.667 and a kappa of 1 respectively, which indicates good to perfect agreement. What they found was that tension type headachers and migrainers had significantly more head pain referral than controls. However, no further validation has been carried out on these techniques, which is why we give them a moderate clinical value. Two techniques have been carried out. For technique one, the patient is in supine lying position and the head is rotated 20 degrees away from the side of the headache, or in case of bilateral headache, away from the side, the spinous process of C2 deviated towards. Then apply pressure over the posterior arch of C1 with one thumb and use your other arm to rotate the head ipsilaterally, which stresses the atlanto-occipital joint and hold this position for five seconds. For the second technique, the patient's head is rotated approximately 30 degrees. Then apply pressure over the contralateral articular pillar of C2 with one thumb, guiding that segment which stresses the C2-3 segment. Hold this position for five seconds. For both techniques, the patient is asked to report on the reproduction of head pain with either yes or no. The explanation for this phenomenon lies in the convergence of cervical efferents onto neurons in the trigeminal nuclei that can refer pain to temporofrontal regions. Let us know if you want a video where we dive deeper into this phenomenon. Alright, thanks again for watching this video. Check out our videos on different types of headaches on the left. Before you leave, make sure you are subscribed to our channel and leave us a like if this video was helpful. As always, this was Andreas for Physio Tutors. I'll see you next time. Bye.